Confidence lesson two. Okay, we are going to talk about something that stems off of the first discussion, the uh, confidence one discussion. The next definition I want to talk about is confidence is a feeling of self assurance arising from one's own appreciation of one's own abilities or qualities. Let's talk about that for a minute. Notice that I put emphasis on one's own, okay? Sometimes you have to shut out the noise. You have to shut out the, the doubters, the haters, the people that tell you who you are, how you are. Do you know who you are? Do you know how you are? Do you know the quality of your worth? Do you know? What is it you know about yourself? If I had to prattle off a list of things about myself that I'm like, oh, you know what? Here we go. I've got self-assurance about a few things. I know that I'm a good cook. I can dance. I'm really good with people for some reason. <laughs> it's like a natural gift of mine. Don't even have to work at it. Um, I... Um, oh, I put other people and even animals before myself. Um, you know, just like whatever it is, like, right? Just find the things that you know, know without a doubt, that you know are you, okay? And appreciate them, okay? Taking the time to appreciate the value you have to the world, to your family, to your households, to your pets, to your loved ones, to your workplace, to your friends, to your admirers, to whoever, okay? Until you know who that person is and you can say, these are things that I know about myself. It makes it easy for people to get in here and ruffle that up. Screw it up for you. Mix it all up and you start to think, Maybe what they're saying is also true. Don't let that doubt in. Don't let that earworm in. That's not you. Be assured. Be assured in your abilities. Be assured of your good qualities. Confidence. <laughs>